Okay. Um, the tape pad ran out. <laughs> Let me cut this off because you're not going to be able to hear me. I'm going to have to over talk it, you know. So that's why, you know, at first you guys was like, why don't you cut the air on on the one, one other previous video? It's because it will be loud, and if it's loud, you can't hear me, and I got to over talk it. So anyway, um, it kind of went off, and they were showing uh, some of the, you know, what's going on in the police and all this and man you know what I I I'm just I was I was just I was spent it's just been a lot going on a lot of lives lost I mean back to back to back to back to back you know what I'm saying we had the, we had the, the the club shooting and then we had you know all this right here jumped off you know these two guys and then the police and the, I mean it's just Man, it's a lot going on right now. It's hot out here, you know. And the other night, Friday night, it was a, a guy and his nine-year-old son and his brother. So it was a grown-ass man and his brother and the grown-ass man's junior son because their, their names was the same. So he was senior and his son was the junior, but three of them got blasted on. I mean, them motherfuckers got straight blasted on the other night. And that's right over there where Isaiah be wanting to go with his partner's house and shit. And I was trying to tell my son that, you know, you're going to have to stop hanging out in these apartment complex. Not not saying that, you know, a lot of shit go down, but a lot of shit do go down in apartment complexes, okay? And so I don't want motherfuckers all coming on me. Well, what the fuck's wrong with the apartment complex? Well, look, check this out. Uh, look, hey, I don't want my son getting involved in no bullshit. I watch too much First 48. I watch too much of this bullshit. And a lot of these kids, you know, let's face it, we don't know what the fuck our kids is doing when they leave our house. You know what I'm saying? When they leave up and around our little regime, we don't know what the fuck, how they acting out in the public, how they doing things or whatever. You know, so, um, you know, I, I, I kind of, I try to stay in my son's head, nigga, I don't want you at the park. I don't want you out here bullshitting. You got drug testers and all kind of shit, nigga, you gonna have on your plate. You better keep your eyes on the motherfucking prize and go where you're going. You know what I'm saying? Do this shit for you. Fuck anything else. Get this shit for you because you gonna need it. You know what I'm saying? And so I don't fuck around and pussyfoot around when it comes down to my kids. I ain't no filter on it. Ain't no sugar coat. No none of that. Nigga, you fucked up. And that's what's happening. Okay, that's how I do mine. And we can understand each other very motherfucking well. Now, mind you, with Isaiah, I can come a little bit more in the raw with him than I would with Anthony. Um, with Tioni, I hit her with a little bit something that I'll hit with her that I won't hit with my sons. You know, when I'm talking with Anthony, me and Anthony, we can communicate on a certain level that I don't talk with them because he's the oldest. So, you know, I, I have to look at my children as all individuals and, you know, it is what it is, you know. But, um... You know, it's just been a lot going on, and it's like, you know, I got to constantly, you know, I just want minds to know, nigga, I love you. You know what I mean? Mama love you, and I'm doing all the fuck I can to ensure that you be successful in this life. I'm doing my part, okay, to put you in the right motherfucking situations and all that other kind of old shit, because I do believe that assimilation and association works hand in hand. You can't be down there bullshit. You got to have all kind of motherfucking friends. Yeah, you can have some friends that can be on some bullshit. These niggas is hooking and crooking and all that old type of shit. Those are your grounders. You need them motherfuckers to keep you grounded, okay? But you also need some motherfuckers in your squad that's going where you trying to go. You know what I'm saying? Then you need somebody in the middle that's still in a struggle like you. So then, therefore, you know, y'all encouraging each other, girl, look, we're going to keep going on this thing. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep going, girl. It's light at the end of the tunnel, baby. I got you. You got me? Bitch, let's go. You know? And and then you got to have, you know, your grounders that's going to say, bitch, if you don't hit this motherfucking blunt, quit bullshit. Yeah. That. You know? So, um, so you know, I just wanted to say that, you know, I'm, I'm silenced on that because I don't need nobody coming back with, my, you know, because everybody got their own view and all that kind of stuff. And when you have a platform, any form of platform, sometimes, you know, your shit can get misconstrued. And, and then the motherfuckers that don't like you no way, they waiting on you to say some shit this way or that way. So then therefore, they, I told you that bitch was so-and-so. I told you that bitch was this right here. I told you that motherfucker. 
And it's like, wow, man. I mean, you know, so you can't really win for losing. And that's just part of the game. It's part of the internet experience. It's part of this shit, you know. So you got to know, once again, when to hold them and when to fold them. So we're going to just leave that on that right there. But, I, you know, I just wanted to... You know, you know, let everybody know that, you know what I'm saying, I see what the fuck's going on. My third eye is sharp. You know what I'm saying? I see what the fuck's going on. I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it, you know. And I got two sons myself and a daughter. Now I got to hold these motherfuckers real close and let them know, look, nigga, uh, look, hey, sit down some motherfucking way. You know what I'm saying? You know, and um, so, anyway, so enough on that. Y'all, I watched motherfucking Love and Hip Hop the other night. That shit was pretty damn good, wasn't it? That shit was good to the motherfucker. That shit was good to me. I like Life Jennings, you know, um, and I thought that that was, you know, I, I mean, you know, I, well, I don't know. I guess, I'm, you know, after you've lived a little bit, you know, um, you kind of see things differently. And I know a girl was like, let's make sure the ring is real or whatever, you know what I'm saying? The thing is, he gave her something. He didn't have to get that bitch shit. He could have just went on and bounced on that bitch. You know what I mean? And been like, you know what? Look, this is right here. Some bullshit, and I'm cool. Now, it, it could be. I, I don't, you know, I mean, but it, who the fuck am I to say? It ain't none of my business. I ain't no way. You know what I mean? But, you know, the way he did that on camera, he let this bitch know, look. And he basically said, you know, what kind of mother? You out here, you know what I'm saying? I want a mother to my kids, nigga. But, you know, nigga, uh, okay. Okay, but yeah, he was like, I need a mother for my kids, and you know, I need a wife. Now, I understood that, you know what I'm saying? He's like, look, check this out. I've been fucking with you for a year and a half. This is what it is. I ain't trying to waste no motherfucking time with it. But I'm like, damn, nigga, y'all motherfuckers. Motherfuckers is really out here having open relationships that ain't giving a fuck about it. Okay, now I'm fucking with you full time, but this right, this bitch right here, head game is cold. I can't help it. I've got to fuck with this bitch from time to time. I'm just telling you right now, I don't hold no feelings for the hoe. Okay? This is a come swallow motherfucker. I need her in my rotation just from time to time. Okay? So, you know, hey, uh, you know, I ain't with it. That's why, that's why, you know, I much rather prefer to say, nigga, don't put me with no motherfucking body because I don't want to get totally attached. I'm guarding my heart. Nigga, I sleep like this. You know what I'm saying? I'm guarding my motherfucking heart like a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Now, yes, I fuck, I fucks with my rose quartz. Yes, yes, yes. That's my shit. You know what I'm saying? My chakras and shit, I'll be, you know, you know what I'm saying? That's my shit, you know, but the thing is, you know, I guard my heart big time because, you know, I done been there and done that, and I don't want to be, I don't want to be, I don't want to be caught up on some bullshit, you know, I don't want to be giving my, all my shit to a motherfucker, and then this motherfucker come turn out to be some bullshit. I'm not getting ready to fuck up my motherfucking get down on a nothing-ass nickel. Fuck all that shit. I ain't trying to get remarried. And some of these niggas be going to straight get remarried on my motherfucking. Well, let's just go on and get married. That's what baby talking about. Baby, I can't. I, 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 uh, no, nigga. Shit. No. I done been there and done it. I done done that shit for so motherfucking long. I can't do it no motherfucking more. Let me enjoy the benefit of saying, nigga, I ain't with no motherfucking body. You can't tell me. That's what I want to be. You know what I mean? I want to be that motherfucker that's bad as fuck. Do you see this bitch pulling up? This bitch is bad. Watch when she step out. Uh oh, there it is. Look at this motherfucker. And she cool as a motherfucker, too. She funny. Bitch, come over here and come hang with her. Yeah, that motherfucker. The way I'm not with nobody, nigga. I'm just doing me. Just like on Saturday. I mean, excuse me. I'm going on Sunday. When I step on that motherfucker, when I come in through the back of that motherfucking stage down there at uh, Jazz Fest West, okay? Nigga, I'm doing me. I'm going to be representing my motherfucking hand. I ain't taking this nigga. I ain't taking Kenny. I ain't taking the other nigga. Not now another motherfucker. I'm I'm taking me and my badass bag right there sitting next to me. I'm taking that motherfucker too. And nigga, uh, I ain't bringing in no sandwiches. I ain't frying up no chicken. I ain't bringing in no sodas and none of that bullshit. Nigga, it's just me and I'm here. What's happening? Now, one thing about having the gold pass, then therefore I don't have to worry about, um, I, I get to park behind the stage, so then therefore I'm parking where, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, what's up, Charlie? Shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm parking next to them motherfuckers. So I ain't got to worry about the whole line and dealing with all that bullshit. I ain't got to worry about bringing no food in because, um, you know, back then the trailers and shit, um, so I get, I get to eat. You know what I'm saying? For free. I get the drink and shit for free. So then, therefore, I ain't got no lawn chairs, no nothing. Bitch gonna have her purse. You understand me? Uh, the gates open up at 10 o'clock. I don't know what time I'm gonna be there. But, uh, nigga, uh, this is what's happening. I'm coming. To ha hey, girl. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to. Mm -mm. I'm there to have a good ass time. 
Now, mind you, Fathead, nigga from 2015, that motherfucker right there gonna be there. He called me the other day, baby, what you doing the weekend? I said, don't worry about it. I don't know. Shit, in the wind, somewhere. Shit, nigga, you don't need to know where I'm gonna be at. But then at the end of it, oh, I'm going to Jazz Fest West. I was just calling to see if you, you know what I'm saying, wanted to roll with me. Nah, nigga. Because and therefore, all your people, you got these motherfuckers up here while you rubbing on my feet and shit, nigga, like we like that. It's going to be a no on that. No, I don't, I don't want to give you no false pretenses that we own all that right in that. Just in case if you want to bite on this motherfucker, if you want to blast me with a little something, nothing, you know what I'm saying, playing. It's jokes. <laughs> it's jokes. Fuck that. That's really some jokes, because with that nigga, that shit's loaded. Hell nah, shit nah. I can't even sit on that fucking nigga's face or nothing. That motherfucker don't act right after that. And I ain't going back to that bullshit, nigga. You ain't finna be following me. You ain't finna be all coming all through my side gates and all that. Nigga, I'm cool on all that. Nope, I'm with nobody. I'm here. I got my motherfucking outfit and shit on. I got my bag. Do you see this motherfucking, all this right here? Nigga, I'm here. Nigga? Huh? I'm on some, the time has come for us to stop fucking around, huh? Yeah, because don't you know that I like having you around in my life, huh? Nigga, I'm Charlie Wilson, uh, Mid Condition, DW3, them my boys, any motherfucking way. Shout out to motherfucking, uh, <clears throat> nigga. Okay, I said I ain't gonna keep doing that. Uh, okay. Shout out to my motherfucking boys, DW3. Shout out to um, uh, Mid Condition, Kindred Family Soul. Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Boney James, Charlie Wilson. Uh. Um. Anyway, but yeah, all of my motherfucking ass coming in through the motherfucking back party in this motherfucker. Hey, hey, girl, hey. So I do know people that are going, but in my party, niggas just me. I don't need no carpool roommates. I don't need none of that old type of shit. I don't need none of that shit. Just me, and I'm. This was happening. So, um, so then therefore, I'm giving my little hair and shit a little break. Um, I've been swimming in the chlorine. You know, chlorine will fuck with your little dresses. So, you know, but, and I had clipped, I had clipped my hair off real good. I don't know if you can really see it, but I had clipped it off real good. And so, but I still got these Afro puffs, but you know what I'm saying? I'm cool with it because I'm not really trying to put no, um, um, uh, chemicals and shit on my hair, especially with the swimming and fuck it up. You know, um, I can't do no real, no real straight styles and shit like that because the steam ain't good for it. The steam fucked my eyelashes off. So, you know. Um, so right now, I'm cool. All the rest of this week, I'm going to be looking pretty much like this. But when I come on, on motherfucking Sunday, um, guys, this is my outfit of the day. And this is right here. I'm on my way to what you call it. You're going to already know what it is already. You know what I mean? I'll be straight out, filleted out, and all that old type of shit. I want to give me some nice little shades, though. You know what I'm saying? I need me, I need me some of these motherfucking, uh, uh, Cynthia Bailey's around this motherfucker. I like her little eyelash, uh, I mean, uh, not her eyelash, her eyewear line. She got some nice little uh, shades and shit. But uh, that bitch said, fuck Peter, didn't she? That motherfucker said, I found out on E! News that she was uh, divorcing my motherfucking ass. Uh, she was supposed to. Nigga, you been doing the mostest, the utmost, for much. Nigga, yeah. She was supposed to say bye-bye, nigga. See you later, bye. Um, nigga, I moved from New York City to all the way down here to be fucking with this, nigga. You still on some bullshit? Nigga, I'm cool. Goodbye, nigga. Whatever. Yeah, go ahead on and say all that bullshit. Um, mama, I'll be getting my money, though, while you bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm certain you done put in help fester some of these motherfucking businesses and shit. Nigga, uh, get yours on the back end. Don't worry about it. The judges be all right when you're telling the truth. You know what I'm saying? When you got documentation to back up some shit, baby, you're going to win. Don't worry about it, because it's been a known fact he ain't had no motherfucking money. So, yeah, now that he got some, get what uh what's due to you. You know what I'm saying? And keep it pushing after that. You still look good, mama. Still got juice going and flowing. Baby, hey, look. <clears throat> it's cool when you ain't got no motherfucking nigga telling you what you can and can't do. Oh, my God, it's good. You know what I'm saying? To get, I mean, I'm not saying for motherfuckers to just say, you know, nigga, fuck this marriage. I'm done with it. No, I'm not saying that. Nor am I... Nor am I you know, an advocate for that motherfucking shit. Because really, we supposed to be in unions and shit. That's what we supposed to be. You know, it's he who finds and all that old type of shit. And I believe in the compounds and all that old type of shit. But when a motherfucking stripping, uh, nigga, if you don't do it moving, I'm cool. 
You know, they just have chicks that just say, fuck it, got a glow about them, don't they? Even though we some low-key, lonely bitches at the house at the end of the motherfucking week sometimes, sometimes we be like, damn, I just wish a motherfucker would hold me. Yeah, we do be like that sometimes, but not that often. But not for me right now because I have been dating, you know, and, you know, I got babies, so, you know, it's not like, you know, I'm by myself, but, you know, still, for the most part, nigga, and even still with him, I'm like, you know what? I mean, we're cool, but you're not really like my husband, though. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you, you, you're not really, you know, my husband, so it's not like you could really, really tell me what the fuck to do now. You know, I let you get away with some shit, but motherfucker, don't take the shit and roll with it, motherfucker, because see, now we're going to fall out, okay? So, yeah. But anyway, um, so that's, uh, that's what's up on that. What else is going on? Um, I had posted some shit the other day, was it a couple days ago on Facebook, we was talking about friends, and I had posted a picture of, you know, the chicks from Set It Off, Jada and all them motherfuckers, and I was like, what happened to the real good, old, good, good, good girlfriends? What happened to them motherfuckers, you know? And what spearheaded spirit, this up is because, you know, um... Uh, some of my girls on my Facebook was putting me up on a few things that I wasn't really aware of. You know, Tina, are you aware of this? No, I really wasn't. But I will address, and I will address it now, and just say that I'm not beefing. Once again, I'm not beefing on this motherfucker with anybody. I, you see, I go and come. I'm not here that often to even beef with nobody. Okay? I'm not on the phone correlating and congregating and conjuring up some shit with anybody on YouTube, um, I have girls on here, yes, you know, girls that I support and things of that nature and girls that I watch and everything, but no, I'm not, in, I'm not involved in anything or any foolishness. I don't want to be, okay? Um, I, once again, I, I, let me say that I wish everybody the best that are making their videos. You know, y'all girls is looking good nowadays. I ain't mad at y'all motherfuckers. Y'all doing y'all thing. You supposed to. You know what I mean? But please, you know, I'm in a different stage in my life right now, and I just wanted that to be, I just want that to be respected. I don't want y'all motherfuckers coming in the feed, oh, well, so-and-so talking about you over there. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to know. I don't want to go over there and go see. I don't want to, okay, watch this video, and then after you watch that one, watch this one. It's going to take you to that one, and then this, 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 that. I'm so surpassed all of that. You know what I'm saying? I, I I mean, I appreciate you guys putting me up on game and shit. But, you know, the thing is, I'm still trying to steer clear of all that shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't trying to fuck with nobody, man. I don't want to fuck with nobody, man. Y'all motherfuckers do y'all thing till you're satisfied. <laughs> Father God, I ask that you bless these ladies. Bless them further, Lord. You know what I'm saying? Filling the, filling the gaps and the open pieces and the blocks and rebuild them in their life to where they're not going through what they're going through, Father God. I don't want to be involved or associated with any foolishness, and please don't bring it to me. I just say that respectfully, you know. I don't want to be, I don't, I don't, I, and, and I ain't mad at nobody. You know, I can't, I can't do them but reiterate that. I'm not mad at anyone, okay? Please, allow me just to have my little private, you know, private life. You know, and because, see, you can't, you know, and especially with relationships and stuff like that, relationships, you know, loving relationships with, you know, those romantic type of relationships, I found now that it is best that you kind of keep that shit on the low and not tell them motherfuckers who you really fucking with. I'm not going to put my dude on here. Not now, 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 I don't give a fuck who the fuck what. I don't want to. You're not going to see his face. Mm -mm. Now, you might see that motherfucking side hand on my thigh, so you might see that motherfucker all this right here, but now nah, you ain't finna uh, do you see that nigga that she fucking with? Blah, blah, blah. Nah, you ain't gonna do me that, okay? I'm not no, 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 no. I've been there and done that, you know, I'm just not I'm just surpassed all of that. I'm just not gonna do it, you know? Um, so, you know, I'm trying to be grown, you know? Can I just be who I am? You know, can I just do me? <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. I'm just trying to do me. You know what I'm saying? Um, oh, y'all, I had got this backpack. Let me show y'all it real quick before I wrap this up because it's 3.38 and I got to go. But I want to show y'all guys. Hold on one second. Let me get my... Um, the other day, I had went to um, the Goodwill. Remember I was telling you guys that, you know, my clairvoyance 
be strong sometimes. You know what I'm saying? And you know, your girl got a few gifts that God gave me. But uh, anyway, I had this urge to just go by the Goodwill, just to go and see what they had as I was going to Albertsons. And um, I had this dream that I had this very nice backpack on, and I was with this handsome, strong man that just made me feel sexy, seen, and safe, you know? And we were at Universal Studios, and in this dream, I don't remember his face. All I can remember his touch, the way he made me feel, and his smell. It was like real surreal, and it was, was a dream. I'd be damned if I had this dream during the weekend, and I bought my backpack today is Wednesday, Monday. Here go my motherfucking backpack, okay? And it's, 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 it's cute. I got it from the Goodwill, so of course it's gently used. It's made by Coach. Um, and I, what, one thing that I do love about it is, you know, it has like this little compartment right here where you can put your money and your cards and all that, man. So I don't even have to put, bring my wallet, you know, if I, you know, if I didn't want to or whatever. Just bring what I'm taking, you know, to Universal Studios because I am going. All right, son, I'm getting ready to get off, okay? And so, but um, but it was $29, $29.99, and I had my 10% veterans uh, military discount. And um, so I love it. But look at the back of it and everything. Isn't that not cute? I mean, it is definitely gently used. I mean, it still has the smell of leather. It's just, I mean, top-notch quality. It's authentic. I mean, man, I came up on this motherfucker. Look at the inside of it. Wow. So, anyway, um, what else did I want to talk about? What else did I want to talk about? Oh, congratulations to my girl Sandy, um, expecting twins, girl. I'm just so happy for you, mama. You know, and, um... You know, I was going to send it in a text or whatever, but I was like, you know what, since I'm, um, you know, going to make a video and then I'll just shout it out and just say, I'm just so happy for you. I'm just so happy for you and hubby. Twins, on the first go round, twins, girl, you got your hands full, mama, but it couldn't happen to a, 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 a most beautiful couple. I'm just so happy for you guys. So, that's what's up on that. Shout out to my girl, um, also Robin. Girl, you are just so, absolutely so gorgeous. And, man, you got a cute little love affair going. I see y'all motherfuckers was at a jazz festival or something over the past weekend or whatever, you and your boo. And, and I'm just, I mean, I just find you to be just so gorgeous and so well put together. And I just want to be as fly as you, okay? I mean, you fly as a motherfucker. And I ain't even, I haven't worn contact lenses, color contact lenses for years, like, Damn, I think I had some in high school and my first year of college. I haven't had them, but baby, you got them motherfucking what you call it on and them motherfucking pictures that you keep posting on Facebook, baby. Beautiful as fuck. I'm like, oh my God, I am surrounded by some real beautiful sisters that respect each other. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my my, my niece, D. That chick's face, stay beat. I don't, she was like, auntie, I'm going to come to California and I'm going to do your makeup one time whenever I come. Baby, I don't, I don't know how y'all do all that shit. I don't know. I don't even know what I would look like if I had all of that on. What I look like somebody else. I don't know. I never had a face beat like that. On what y'all call it. Face beat. I ain't never really had one of them beat, up, beat ups like that. So I don't know what that do. But man, baby. The way you put all that shit together and all them eyeshadows and all that. Man, just absolutely gorgeous. Oh my God. Absolutely gorgeous. You guys really make me want to buy a palette or two. I'm not bullshitting. Between D and Robin, baby, look. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Michi, oh my God, baby, you've been traveling all over the motherfucking place. I'm like, oh my God, this bitch is in Dubai, Guam, uh, motherfucking Guam, and Acapulco. I'm like, oh my God, bitches, you want to hut this week? Girl, I'm not mad at you. Oh my God. These are girls when I look at them, I'm like, these are my, you know, if I had to pick a squad, if I had my dream squad, my dream, dream, dream squad, if I had my way, oh my God, oh my God, it would be strong. <laughs> it would be strong. If I just had my way, you know what I mean? Because, oh my God, I like Shonda, like Shonda says, you know what I'm saying? And so, um, she would be part of my squad, man. 
Robin, fucking Dana, D, because D going to have us together. You know what I'm saying? 50 is going to have all our nail game on 10. You know what I mean? Michi gonna be having our motherfucking hairlines all hooked up with these motherfucking full laces and shit we gonna be throwing on. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, man, so D gonna have our faces beat to the, to, what, what you say, beat to the gods or however y'all say that shit? Yeah, all that other type of shit. But it would be about a good 10 deep. I don't wanna really be name dropping like that because somebody, but how come you didn't say my name? You know, some motherfucker feel a particular kind of way. But I got to really go. I got to really, 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 really go. Shout out to Amber Rose. Baby, you got your motherfucking show. I ain't mad at it. Um, And I'm gonna leave that there. Um, And so, uh, I'm out of this piece. Taking my son to work. It's a quarter to four. I gotta go get my babies. I took them and dropped them off at a little tutoring. You know what I'm saying? Even though it's summertime, y'all motherfuckers still. Ain't that something? Listen to my son. Hey, button. Hello? All right, I'm on, mommy's on her way. I'm on my way. I'm on my way, son, okay? So, anyway, let me go. I got to get going. On that note, family, I'm gone. You know what I'm saying? Um, I, I want to do this a little bit more better than what I've been doing, but, you know, I've been kind of silenced. I needed to be. You know, I needed to handle some business, and sometimes when you a real trill nigga, you can't come on this motherfucker on some small talk shit. You know what I'm saying? Because you letting cats and shit out the bag and all kind of shit. You saying shit you don't need to say. So, then therefore, sometimes, like I said, you got to know when to hold them and when to fold them and when to shut the fuck up. And I've had to shut the fuck up on numerous occasions. And that's one reason why I don't, you know, I haven't been here. Anyway, I'm gone. See y'all later. Y'all have a good day. Have a good week. I'm going to holler at y'all by the end of the week because we're going to Jazz Fest West. Holler. Bye.